Um, all right, so we have two locations. Postal 633, uh, I believe it's up on... Cougar Ave, um, that'll be location number two. Location number one is 575, it's across from the 24-7 up there on Clinton in that big car park with the um, fence around it. Um, there's a few alleyways and stuff there that we can all get in position and get behind. All right. Not sure who we're looking yep. out for or anything like that. We just had some, you know, a lot of cars getting stolen lately. So we thought we'd try and get ahead of it and try and get some perps and interrogate some people. And hopefully we might be able to get some, you know, names of why and who and stuff like that and where it's getting distributed to once they steal them and stuff like that. Any questions or any concerns or anything like that? Uh, does it have a GPS tracker? Yes. Copy. Uh, is anyone in a marked unit? Yeah, I'm in a marked Impala. Okay, everyone else is in an unmarked, I'm guessing. Yeah. McGee, you in an unmarked or a marked unit? Yep. Unmarked. Okay. Uh, what was that, Jake? Is the plan to let marked um, attempt trap stop once uh, once the vehicle's moving, and let unmarked uh, filter in as needed, or? Um, it probably just filter in as needed because uh, we're gonna have to shut it down pretty quick. The last thing we want is them getting a. a a way out of the tracking range or something for the key to turn it all off and then we're never going to keep up with a Audi R8 so um, once it's deactivated early we'll just all roll in and we'll have the march unit close by so at least he's still on the scene at some point any other questions or anything no uh since I'm in a mark unit, uh, do you want me to stage a couple of blocks away or stay right close to the area? Um, we'll have you close by, but yeah, a few blocks out and we'll have the unmarks, um, especially the unmarks that blend really well. We'll have them closer and stuff like that. Um, we do have a, a police issued van downstairs that if we want, we can take it out and be even closer if we need to. It's got surveillance gear in there with cameras and all that kind of thing in it. Um, so if that's all we can roll though. cameras in my vehicle can't even get fixed in a week. Uh, love the mechanics. All good then? Yes. Alright, I'm ready to roll if everyone else is. Good, you good. Okay. Um, let's go and get our vehicles and we'll head up to, um, 575 at the car park there. Um, one of us will have to drive the Audi up there. I'm not sure who wants to do that. No, not it. I, mean, I can drive the Audi and then hide in the detective car. Yep, that's fine if you want to do that. Yeah, that'd probably work actually really well. Alright guys, we're just showing up here. We're gonna park down an alleyway probably here somewhere. Probably this one to be quite honest. Looks like Styles is coming in here as well. Hey, make sure you call me later. 535 160. Go ahead. Advise, I'm set to pull out onto Spanish Avenue between Postal 569 and 577 right now. Hey fam, if you want to hang around down on Spanish and sort of Elgin and then just in that couple of area block, um, you should be good. Time for. Five. 535, each of the 734 at the gas station at 596 on Clinton. I'm Mark Grace over on. 
Cobby, I'll be at Postal 574 in a car park just behind the 24-7 in a grey Caprice, I believe. Uh, 128 is out here as well, back further in the alleyway. We're both playing close, though. We might go on foot eventually here. We might just go ahead and tuck our badge in. Just gotta go and talk to these guys really quick. I had to clear my cache so it's a little... Oh, there's Styles there. Hey. Oh, uh, where's the TR officer? Uh, I let him take my car since uh, I'm just gonna stand on by foot. Yeah, yeah, good idea, because there's a few alleyways over like here sort of thing, which would be a good spot for another mar another unit to be in, you know? Yeah. Alright. Whereabouts is exactly is this car? It must be in the corner a bit more, is it? Yeah, I have no eyes on it yet, so probably. Oh yeah, just with the door open. Perfect, perfect. Perfect. Well, it might now it's a waiting game. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Might get myself a coffee. You want one? Mmm, that sounds lovely. Hi, two coffees. Uh, I'll have a hot chocolate, five, sorry. Five, I'll be in the parking lot across the bank at postal 568. 10 four. Yeah, sorry, a hot chocolate. Sorry, that was the right Uh Yeah, hot chocolate with two sugars. Uh, what do you want, Roberts? Uh, the same. All right. Thank you. Yep, here's the money. All right. Thanks, sir. Thank you. Here's yours. Thank you. All right. You just want to sit on the other side of me. Just, I'm just trying to cover my earpiece yeah. a little. Luckily, I have hair. Yeah, yeah. I was thinking maybe I should have grown my hair for something like this. You know, I need to look a bit more. You know, raggy in terms of hair. Scruffy. Mm -hmm. True. Style, style, style. What? There it is. That's your own What do we listen to? All units be advised there's three uh, black Impalas kind of going around the area. Ten for three black Impalas in the area. Hey, it's Reed. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, no, I was just ringing you. I saw them as well, but it looks like you already had eyes. Mm hmm There's three of them. Yeah, I'm just going to stay on, on the phone to you. Okay. They're definitely circling the block. Yeah, definitely. I'm going to be just down on the corner of Power and Clinton. I'm just gonna be in the store trying to hide myself. You said you're in the store. Metro 128, be advised one of these black and polish just parked itself in the car park near the vehicle. 128104. I'm gonna walk up towards you. You're inside the 24-7? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna walk straight past. Straight the door. The 
Looks like he's just sitting in his car. And he's got a. I can't tell if there's like a. There's a guy walking up to his Impala, wearing a hat by the looks of it. Is that a whiskey mic or a Bravo mic? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a whiskey mic. Wearing a, a full hat, green or black in colour. There's another. There's another guy walking up there with a beanie. They're all wearing black clothing. Call that in. Yeah, call that in. I can't. Metro one twenty eight. Um, be advised, there's two uh, whiskey mics in the area. Currently, one of them right next to the car. Uh, both wearing hats. One two eight ten four. Two tons by Mills in the area near the car. Hey. Hey. Is that a third one that just showed up? Yeah. Metro 535, we have another Impala that just entered the car park. I think we're up to times three individuals inside the car park right now. All acting suspicious, all wearing black shirts and black pants with black hats or beanies. I believe one individual did look at the car and so like went up to the open door, looked in and then walked off. Might be looking around the area. Five three five ten four. Are they all white males? Uh, we believe so. We're a bit of a distance away. Ten four. Hey, I might try and just walk I through the car park and come out the other side. Yeah, go ahead and do that. I'll keep an eye here. Uh, the guy that was actually, you want to do that because I'm just worried my earpiece picture. might give me away. You want to just walk straight through because you look. You look great, Roberts. Oh, mm, thank you. Mhm. Mm I'll ring you. Or should I walk him forward or? Walk straight through and then out the other end. I'll keep an eye on you. Okay. Okay. Just try and get an identification on them, what they look like. No, sorry, sir. We're just using your shop okay. for uh, surveillance. It's okay. We're police officers. Um. Yep, you're good. Uh, so just act okay. normal. Just uh, act normal. It That's all good. It, it might be suspicious that I crossed the road there, so I'm gonna go over there, go behind the, the other entrance, and come down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. That sounds great. I, I'd love to have that for dinner tonight. Mm -hmm. Metro I'll be, back in one six. One One six zero ten four. Oh, sorry about that. Um, we had a visitor walk in, you know. Oh. Yeah, one of them walked in. 535, I believe one is a female uh, wearing sunglasses and dark hair, possibly. It's unknown. 535, that's what times one possible female. She might be just skinny. She just kind of looked like a female, I'm not sure. I'm gonna try and casually walk by and try to get a plate on one of these vehicles. Yeah, keep walking around the block, maybe. Looks like they're just surveilling. <laughs> five one eight from five thirty five. Go ahead. What 20 are you at? I'm gonna be at 568 in the parking lot. Copy, and 734, you're at 596. That's 10 4, corner of Fenwell and Clint. No eyes on any. What's suspicious? Yeah, copy that. What'd you get? It's difficult to see without coming up too close to it. Hold on. I tried to take a picture without looking too suspicious. Yeah, I've kind of had to walk off because they keep walking straight past this sort of thing, you know? Yeah, the three of them are near the, uh, kind of like that little cubicle right there. They're talking. I don't know what they're doing. Right, I'm going to try and get five. I'm going to try and get 734 on the line for a sec. 
734 from 535. 734, guys. You still in plain clothes? 1050, but I can take the bus, so it can take me a minute. AFM, can you do that and then um, try and park somewhere closer and do a walk by? I believe I was compromised. I'm just going to get in my car and just drive off. Ten four, I'm going to do a walk by of your location or the bank car location. Um, yeah, just take my spot. I'll switch out and go down where you were. I just think I was compromised. That's all. And I want to give them any reason. I think I don't want to give them any reason. I think you know we're watching them. I gotta hang up for a sec. Yeah. Five thirty five one two eight, I'm leaving the area. Seven thirty four is gonna come in as your backup. Ten four. We'll try and get a plate on this vehicle in front of us. Metro 535. 535, let's head to us. Stand by for a 1028. 10 We have the right of way, but you go. You go. Metro 535. Good. 28's gonna be Echo Hotel Union Echo 0525. Echo Hotel Union Echo 0525. Should come back to a black Chevy Impala, possibly a 2006 model. Five three five. Los Santos confirm Echo Hotel Union. Echo 0525. Copy. 10 not coming back in the vehicle system. 10 4, just keep that on the call notes. 10 4. Alright, so it's not coming back, we're just gonna keep doing the block, because. Um, like I said, we were kind of compromised. I don't think we we're compromised as a cop, but it just looks really suspicious if we just keep hanging out there on our phone and stuff, so it's best just to leave and do a block. Metro 128, be advised, the, uh, one of the black impalas is currently uh, blocking the view to the vehicle. Suspect is in the vehicle. Car's taking off. 128. 10-4. Car's taking off. All right, the they, Impala's following. They're taking the bait car. Let's move in. 312, deactivate the car. They went down Power Street. Went southbound. 10 4. Ten four southbound Power Street. Subject of the vehicle 2342. Looks like they're continuing southbound. They just blew a red light. I've lost eyes on the R8. I've still got eyes on the Impala. I'll stick with the Impala. It's running lights. We're on Alta. I'm in a 10:31 with the other black in parlor. I'll say 35 to 3 on the channel. Negative. Are they going to go for the other car? Give me a 10:28. Vehicle just brake checked me. We're going to be going back northbound Alta. 10:4 northbound Alta. We're now going eastbound on Vespucci. Ten 
car with that. I believe I saw the other one was Lower Power Street. Advise, I've got the other one northbound Alton. They don't have eyes in the Audi. Three twelve, you got a tracker on the Audi still? Tracker on the Audi died. Copy. Kill switch was hit though. Copy, they should be locked in it somewhere then. My pursuit's now eastbound on Brogue. Now on Confidence. Never eastbound Confidence. We're now northbound on Roy Lowestine. Going westbound on Carson. Never 128, what's your 1021 with the other vehicle? Ah, uh, B-Buzz, I can't get close enough to it at the moment. This reg to the Mega Mall is continuing. Vehicle dude, we're just circling the Mega Mall currently. Advised second and Paul is going to be on Forum Drive at this time. Heading northbound. Copy, just go after one in Go ahead. Do you want us to cancel uh, chase of Audi? Uh, is it killed, you said? Send all units to the Audi and just send me one unit for my pursuit on Grove. 312, I have the Audi, looks like they climbed out a window. Copy. I'm still in the seat with the Impala, we're northbound Davis. I've got both Impalas here. 5354 northbound Power Street, 312, what's your testimony with the Audi? Impala, they're running into one Impala now. 5354, what's your testimony with the Audi? Shots fired, shots fired. Send all units this way, we've got shots fired. Temporary shots fired, lower Power Street, all units respond. All personnel on the frequency respond, lower Power Street. Temporary foot bailing on the Power Street, all units respond, 535. Power. Put your hands up, dude. Hands up. Advise put one subject down. Hands up. Dude, put your hands up. One six zero ten four subject signal seven. Five thirty five butcher ten twenty and lower power street cross over. Dude, hands up. Step out of the vehicle slowly. Step out. How am I supposed to get out of this thing? I don't care, crawl! Look at this. Hey, Dave, Keep your hands up. 535, roll EMS as well, we've got a GSW uh, on a subject, he's down. Currently one at gunpoint as well. Do not move! Five thirty five ten four. County ten seventy one from the center of the left and route. Five three five. And now your location. We're gonna be at Davis at the Mega Mall. We've got one subject down at GSWs and we've got another subject ten fifteen. Down four, Davis Street at the Mega Mall. And be advised, we've still got the GSW subject at gunpoint. Step one. One six zero advised. I'll be with the down subject at this time. Uh, guns currently away. Be advised, I'm also I'm also hit as well. One six zero ten four. Our unit is all stable. Stay by 312, 128, are you 10-4? 10-4. We have the bait car secure though, correct? 312 will be with the bait car. Copy, we have two subjects here, it means that the, the one who got away from the bait car is probably still at large. He was a whiskey mic as well, wearing all black. See if we can get it out of this guy. Well, that was a shit show. Hey guys. Yeah. 
I don't, was, you kept saying low power. We, um, I kept going up and down low power, and then, um, then you said the Davis Mega Mall. Was, yeah, um, I stopped uh, giving twenties because I was trying to get right? most of you to go to the bait car, but it looked like he bailed anyway. That's why I started giving twenties again. I was trying not to be too confusing. I wasn't too worried if this guy got away, he wasn't in the bait car. But as long as we got the bait car, it's all good. We don't want him having a, like right. a million dollar yeah, car, yeah, right? Yeah. Exactly, and then we don't have to worry about getting another one for the next time or something like exactly. that. Exactly. And then one of them wrecked in that other impala, then this one here picked her, uh, picked him up, and then 160 tried to box him in because they were on the footpath, and they started shooting at his vehicle, and then they started shooting at me, so I put a few rounds into him. They have taxpayers some dollars? Yeah, I have one who's not hurt or anything in the back of my car, if you want to talk to her. I think it's a him, actually. I think it. I think it's bold. I was actually gonna um, help out with the bait car scene. Oh yeah, you good then. Yeah, you here. can clear off if you're good, Diggy. Yeah, yeah, I'll go. I'll go reinforce him. What do you need from me? Hmm. Just come over here. We'll chat to this fella. Three twelve. What's you in the uh, bait car twenty one four? Uh, actually, I'll clear the. Um, um, I'll back there on the road. Okay. Roger, I'll be around. Let's put my vest back, my um, badge back on. So that everyone knows I'm a police officer. Go ahead and step out for me. What are you running from the police for? It's not on part of the job, my guy. Well, you won't need that. Wow. You got anything on it's gonna stick, Pogo Hermy? Um, I mean, I saw the gun you never took off me. Okay. What are you carrying a gun for? Hi, I've got an uh, officer laying down here. What's the MS EJ? I went in and I routed um, onto County Think I'm going to go that one? Mm -hmm. You're nuts. You're a psycho. Well, I'm just going to let you know you've been arrested fleeing and eluding an attempted murder on a police officer. 10 4. Oh, that's lovely. Alright, come this way. Watch your head. My car's probably fucked up to everyone else, so we'll just fix it. Hey, you got a make it? No, here, here you go. Uh, I just saw him drop, so... I've got a med kit for you. Thank you. I'm just trying he's, to secure uh, the rest of the scene as well. He's got three GSWs. He's got low posts. Oh, his post is alright, but it's, it's dropping slowly. What about this guy? Five, when he, five, when he fell. Well, that was interesting. Got two impalas there to secure. As long as they don't get missing, we'll be good. We luckily weren't hit. Um, was there an ATA on that ambulance? Yeah, it should be about 30 seconds out now. Cow's got bullet holes in his neck and shoulders, so uh, should probably transport him first. Yeah, yeah, he takes priority. Alright, that's them turning up right now. Yeah. Metro 128. 
What's All right, I got ID on this guy. He's got a weak pulse, but he's still here. me at 754 attempting to collect the video surveillance of the area. Yeah, okay, he's got... He's... Yep, he's gone. All right. I'll help you out with him. Four GSWs. I'm trying to keep pressure on him. What do we lose at this? 10 four. Got a wallet here as well. Bill, Bill Turner is the name. Never met him before. Don't know about you. Uh... Yeah, we, we dealt with Bill before. I think he oh, had good. a warrant out. I'm not sure if he's still got a warrant out. Oh, okay. He ran from us as in, in a bank robbery, I believe. Well, now he's running from us again and shooting at the police. So we've got fleeing and eluding, obstruction of justice, attempted murder of a police officer. Hmm. We'll make sure we get the prints of everyone yeah. that we have in custody as well and check that Audi R8 for prints as well. Copy. Metro 535 uh, to 3. Correction, 734. Well. Can you take prints of the Audi R8? We're going to take prints of the guys we got down here as well. Yeah, for All right. Uh, medics, yeah, four GSWs to the abdomen with uh, applied pressure and all that. He's got a light pulse. Yeah. All right, I'll move out of your way. Um, all right. This one has no ID on him, apparently. So, well, we'll guess we'll, print him. yeah, I guess we'll check the cars. So... Uh, so the driver is the one we've shot. He was the passenger who bailed out of the car over there. Interesting. Yeah. Um, I'll clean up. Looks like we've got some shell casings in the area. I'll clean those up for okay. Detective One Lincoln. Oh yeah, his car's got some bullet holes in it. I, I, it probably does not look that fucked up for him, to be quite honest. So... Like, even Sahil's missing his front, so it is what it is. It's probably just deer sync. Yeah, that thing is fucked. No wonder he didn't run. Uh, we need some gloves and fresh pair of gloves. We just need some blue ones. Yeah, black would have been fine actually, but I will. Yep, that'll do. Impala closest to the gas station has an ID and glove box and an extra set of gloves. Okay. We'll start with that one then. This Impala looks like it's done for as well. get it off the road just so it's not causing any issues. Thing is fucked. I think it's E bum bin. Impala close to the gas station has an ID, like I said, in the glove box and has an extra set of gloves. Okay. Don't see anything in the trunk. Alright, we'll grab that. And this apparently has two mags and some empty shells in it.
uh, bag, bag and tag the um, shell casings I found. Okay, there's some more in this car if you want to bag them in. Um, I just got to go over to him real quick because I found an ID on him. In his car about him, so... Okay. Alright. There's a couple of empty... There's, sorry, uh, there's not empty. There's a couple of magazines on the ground there too. You weren't willing to tell me your name, but I found an ID. Hopefully it's you. Metro 535. 535, we'll Can you roll two times 1070 to our location? It's gonna be for two black Impalas. Peep. 535, 10 4, 2 times, county, 1070, uh, Casey's, to truck services. Isn't that what he said? Or did I spell that wrong? R P E W. Metro, make that 3, we need one for the, um, for 160s in parlor as well. Realize it's been shot uh, about 4 bullet holes from what I can see. Oof. 518, 10 4, I'll make that 3. Q W Y D. Peewee, is that your name? Looks like you. Is it? It's alright, you can still sit there and deny it. he looks like you, and I'm sure when I run your fingerprints it'll be a match, so... Cool. Ah, uh, cool. Mm-hmm. I need to go and check some plates out really quick. Oh. Seriously, someone's gonna ring me right now? We're trying to do things. Oh, it's Julie. Raid. Hey, it's Roberts. Yep. Um, so I'm just here trying to trying to collect some of the uh, surveillance footage from surrounding buildings. Um, the 24 7 uh, kind of does have a good shot looking at it. Um,. It's just, it's very odd, because it's like, they were prepared for this, like, there was three of them, um, from the video I see, and they all wearing black hoodies, black attire, it's just very interesting, I'm gonna see if I can get some, like, tattoos or something, or some markings that can link who they are, um, where are you headed? Uh, we're still down here processing the scene, we've got a downed officer, um, possibly life-threatening injuries, the second subject who shot at us, he has life-threatening injuries for GSWs, um, the other perp is in the back of my car, he's not very talkative, a bit of a smart ass. um, so if we can try and get some surveillance footage of the third individual that we're missing, who possibly took the bait car and ditched it, somehow. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna try and see what I can find. Alright, yeah, we've got some... One Impala down here has some... a couple of extra magazines in it. The guy who shot at us, his Impala had some more magazines in it. Uh, yeah. So they would definitely had some ammo uh, and all carrying on... guns. Do you plan on interrogating the other guy that you have in your back of your car? Yeah, probably, yep. Okay. At Mission Row or uh, BPD? Uh, probably, yeah, probably Mission Row. We're on the south east side of the city, so yeah, Mission. Five, three, okay. five, three, four. Uh, I'll just collect all that and uh, I'll be there. Okay, goodbye. Go for 535. Are we going to try and use this car again or do you want, them, or do you want us to just have it towed back 10 pounds? Oh, let's just get it towed for now. We're going to have a bit of... We're going to be on this scene probably for a few more hours processing. 10 4. Uh, Metro 312. 312 Los Santos. Alright. Can I get a 1070 to my location? Uh, near postal 384. This isn't the plate that I ran earlier, I don't think. H E. Oh, HP. 312 Los Santos, 10 4, 384 Elta Street. 
The toes are arriving, by the way, so whenever you're ready to let them go, they've already taken the 160s Impala. Um, they're good to go, both Impalas can go. I was just checking to make sure this plate came back to Bill Turner, which it does, and that one over there comes back to Peewee... Peewee Herman. Interesting name. Copy that. Yeah. I'll get that one tilt first. Okay, sounds good. Alright. Pee Wee. What the fuck do you want? Alright, so I'm Detective Reed with the Lance Sartans Police Department, okay? Santos. Interesting. So, currently you've been charged and arrested for fleeing and eluding attempted murder of a police officer. Um, gonna try and get you for possession and conspiracy to steal a vehicle. Um, and aggressive and careless and reckless driving. So at the time, you do, ha you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do may and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you by the state of Los Santos. Do you understand? Sure. Do you still wish to talk to us? One, two, eight, and three, two. Oh, do it. What was that? Go ahead. So, I don't know. Do it. Well, I'm asking you. Do you want to talk to us? Because I can help. I can try and help you out and get rid of a charge or two, yeah. and maybe you won't spend the next 30 to 40 years in prison. Maybe you'll spend five to ten years or something, okay? Alright, cops knock off charges. Yeah, fucking right. That's about like a lie just to get information of me. I mean, if you want to spend 40 plus years in jail, then go for it. I'm trying to help you out and offer you a deal. Yo, prove it to me that you're actually going to be able to do that. So you want to you want to sign document, do you? Some sort of proof that you know actually assures that. Okay, well, if I'm gonna give you get you a signed document, you need to give me something. Did you shoot at the police? From the car. So you shot at a police officer from the car. I didn't shoot at the one that was laying dead in front of us. Alright, well, I have to consider making a deal because I don't so, normally make deals with people who decide to shoot at police, okay? Yeah, see, you can make that choice real quick. Because until then, this up. Yeah, it's good. fine by me at the moment, sir. Shut. Oh, you stupid fucking thing. We all good here then? Yep. Alright, thanks for the backup. That was a little crazy. No problem. We're good to open this up. Yeah, yep. Uh, I'm gonna head down to Mission Row. Just need to get rid of these gloves. Copy. Um, do you need me to do anything? I think we have all the suspects, right? Oh, the ones we got. Um, we got all these suspects apart from one. Uh, 128 is currently trying to get some CCTV footage of the area of 575 and um, other businesses going sort of down those roads um, where they went trying to get an ID on our third one from the R8. Yeah. Um, I is the other guy in, I'm assuming, ICU or whatever? Oh, yeah, we'll have to get in contact with Pillbox as well. Are you right to do that and see if he made it? And pick him up if need be. Yeah, we'll do. Yep. All right. Thanks, officer. Well, stay safe. All right. So we're gonna head back to Mission Row, and we'll interrogate this chap probably. See what he knows. I don't know if I want to give him a deal. He shot a police officer, and he's in the hospital. So I don't know if I really want to make a deal with him. Metro five thirty five. Five, 
I've been route to Mission Row PD with 1 times 10 15. Alright, we're just going to head to Mission Row, guys, and we'll start the booking process on this chap. Alright, we're going to start on the arrest report. I don't really care for much for the intel that he's got. Actually, let's ring Styles really quick and see if he's got anything. Because if he has, if if Styles has her, like the other, the third person or something, and we don't need this person, then that's good. Uh, Read for Dr. Roberts. Roberts. Yep. Uh, do you have any intel on CCTV footage of our third subject? I do. Um, I'm gonna head to the station and show you. We also have a backpack and some interesting documents in this bag. Right. I just want a quick question answer though. Do we have an ID or anything on our third subject? Because this person that I have wants a deal, and I don't really want to give them a deal. They showed up police, and they're not very cooperative anyway. So I don't really want to give them a deal. Uh, I don't know what the other subjects look like, but the one that got in the car had a fedora and did not have a beard. And I got a license. Oh, he was the one with the hat. Of one of the vehicles. Was he? Yeah, yeah. Well, what, one of them was wearing a beanie, a hat, and a French fedora. Um, oh, okay. The one with the French fedora got in the vehicle. He didn't have a beard. I also got a play, and there was a Pee Wee Herman that came back registered to that vehicle. I yeah, that's the, that's the one I have in custody. Have. That's the one I have in custody. I ran a plate on a black okay. Impala outside the cinema that didn't come back to anyone. Um, dispatch might still have the plate. Um, just see if they have it. Might be able to get something more off that. Yeah. Okay. I'm almost at station. Okay. Um, do you know where 312 is? Yeah, he's with me. He's giving me a ride. Oh, okay. Alright. I'm gonna see if that other Impala's up at... 518 from 535. Go ahead. Um, did that other subject survive? Uh, unknown. I'm making inquiries now. Copy. Alright. Let's go ahead and Pee Wee Herman. Let's go ahead and start this arrest report. So, hey, hey, uh, Pee Wee Herman is in interview room one. I haven't interviewed him. Like I said to you on the phone, he wants a deal, but I mean, he ran from the police. He shot at police, and to be honest, he's been quite arrogant and smart. To be honest with me, and I don't really want to give him a deal. Okay, so from the surveillance footage, it looks like when they got up to the car, they immediately started the plan. Like, this this wasn't just they found a car and they wanted to take it. Like, I don't know if they were planning to steal a car at some point. Maybe they just found this one. But uh, they clearly go around, and I even saw it myself. They were pretending to be on their phone and looking around to see if there were any cops. Okay. Uh, there was a backpack left. Uh, the backpack seems to contain a bunch of papers, and I quickly skimmed through it, and it's something about an old business owned by Sandrina King, hmm. which that's interesting. Um, no idea who that is. Yeah, she's someone from a case I'm working. It's a long story. Um, okay. The description of the male who took the RA is a white male. He had a black fedora on, black trench coat with black pants. Uh, black undershirt and gloves. Um, that's pretty much all we could. So we're not gonna get fingerprints from him cameras. at all. I doubt that he is wearing gloves. Still have CSU. Um, the R eight's gone down to the to the garage, hasn't it? For um, forensics. Uh, R eight was towed to impound, but I know seven three four. Did some preliminary fingerprinting and pictures of it before it was. Okay. Well, um, does the R eight have a camera in it? Don't most bait cars have cameras in them? Yeah, it should do. Should be in the center console somewhere. Five three five five one eight. Stand by. Maybe you can run facial. Five thirty five. Uh, be advised, our suspect made it. He's uh, stable and talking. Currently ah. in uh, patient room one. Uh, oh, sorry, two seven one, three seven one. Uh, but uh, they say he's gonna have about three days of recovery time. Copy. Is he allowed to see visitors? 
Yeah, Aoife. Copy. I want to see if you can get an ID or a physical description of our outstanding subject. Tampa, you want me to do that or wait for one of you to come down? Uh, you can do it. Tempo. Um, yeah, because this Bill Turner guy who was the subject we've shot down and who's at Pillbox right now, he has a history and it looks like there's a call note there from Lieutenant Henry saying that he's quite chirpy and stuff and likes to give up details, so maybe he'll give us something that we want. Possibly, yeah. Do you too. want to try and have a crack at the guy in interview room one, maybe? Maybe he'll open up to you because you're a female? Uh, yeah, I can try. Say that you're like the senior detective. Act like you've got more authority or something and that you can give him what he wants, maybe? If he gives you something decent? Yeah. 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 All right, I'll do, what I can do. Yeah, I'll do the arrest report. If that doesn't work, then yeah. good cop, bad cop, I guess. He's in room one, right? Interrogation? Yeah, interrogation room one. Should be on the seat with the cuffs. Pee-wee Herman, is that correct? What an interesting name. Yeah, yeah, Pee-wee Herman. That's him. Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna take my purse off. Detective? So I was just doing paperwork on the fingerprints that we took out of the Arnie, out of the Arnie. Yeah, Detective Roberts just said that apparently the description she's got and the CCTV footage she's seen, um, the guy who took the R8 was wearing gloves, so that's a bummer. But the... Yeah, we didn't get too much. The R8 should have a camera, but it's going to take text probably a couple of days to, or a day or something, I guess, to get some sort of um, composite of him, I guess. So hopefully we can get something out of the camera that was in the console. Alright, yeah. I think Roberts is going to take a crack at the guy in interview room one if you want to go in there and help her. Um, he, he wants a deal and stuff, but I don't really want to give him a deal. He shot at police, he ran from the police, he... Um, he's just very, very smart, thinks he's arrogant and all that, so I can't be bothered. Especially if Turner's still alive, he might give us something. I'll yeah, I'll listen in. Son of a bitch. Try and do me reports. This is the hell. Guarantee it. Detective Reed, LSPD. Hey, this is uh, Officer McGee. Um, I asked him a few questions. He says they met on Twitter. He's not giving me much, he's saying he, the man on Twitter, he does jobs uh, for the money and uh, doesn't know anything about them. Uh, I think we confiscated his phone though, so uh, we should be able to pull the Twitter handle, but that's yeah. something you guys will have to do. Um, but, but he's not giving me anything, he's uh, saying that he doesn't know them, doesn't know their Twitter handle, or anything right. like that. So. Okay. Um, so currently we have him for attempted murder of a police officer, fleeing and eluding, obstruction of justice, uh, Conspiracy to commit a car theft. Um, so you might want to let him know that he's under arrest and reading his rights and maybe that he might want to cooperate, otherwise he's going to spend the next 50 years in jail. I did all of that. He says he will take what he can get. Right, okay. Well, I hope making zero dollars was well worth it today for him. I guess so. Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you. No problem. I'll just write him up here on his charges and uh, we'll file it. Can, then, I guess, can you ask him one question though for like a, like a like a description? Of, like, did he give you any kind of description of the other guy? No, I tried as, on that as well. He will not give anything. He says he doesn't remember. Anything. Well, he doesn't really know anything. All right. Thanks, officer. No problem. Julie, um, Julie, there's like two of you. Oh, there you are. Yeah, she's. She's just my twin. She's being annoying today. Okay. Um, anyway, um, Dicky McGee, um, officer said that Turner isn't giving him anything. He claims he doesn't know. He doesn't know them. Apparently, they. Cl he claims that they met on a Twitter post about um, doing a job together and making some money, and that's all he's aware of. And his phone is in an evidence bag in the trunk of my Caprice in the back car park.
Um, okay, so, uh, what was the name of that guy? Did he, did he get a name? Uh, for the one we're still missing or Bill Turner who's in hospital? Okay, it's Bill Turner who's in the hospital. Okay, yeah, he's going to be in there for a few more days. The description matched. The Mr. Uh, Herman uh, just told us, uh, basically gave the perfect description that matches to the name of uh, Elwood Belushi. Oh, so we don't have to give him a deal. He just gave it all up, did he? No, he just... I just told him to give me what I want, and that's that. Um, what did you offer him? Detective? Von Lincoln? Nothing. Nothing. He just spilled his guts to you. Nothing. She it's just, she just asked, uh... The guy thing, maybe. I think it's a guy thing. I was getting attitude and he wouldn't give me his, like, tell me his name or anything. Wow. I'll just call you next time, detective. Yeah. Oh, so he's making a deal with a scumbag. Mitchell, 518. Alright, well, um, oh, um... I haven't got much else to do. I'm just going to finish up this arrest, arrest report. Of, uh, uh, one of you able to grab the evidence out of my caprice, uh, if you don't mind? And, uh, officer 161. Yeah, we uh, might want to start on a warrant for that Elwood guy. Yeah, let's. we'll try and do a raid. It's going to be a bit late. He's going to be laying low. Probably won't be home tonight, but um, maybe try for a raid at his um, residence maybe tomorrow or something. What do you guys think? Yeah, possible. Yeah, I'm good yeah, with that. Works. Five yeah, just stand by. I've got what, 312 looking up at the cinema for that other Impala that was still up there that didn't come back when I did the play. Go 535. Okay. Did you say that Impala was on Vinewood Boulevard in front of the cinema? Yeah, AFM, it's going to be just about 200 metres east of the Pacific Standard Bank. Should be facing westbound, I believe, in the lot there. Yeah, it's going to be parked on a car space just on the street there on the intersection of, I believe, Power. Be advised, dispatch should still have a 28 for that vehicle. 535, uh, Hopefully that car's still up there. Echo. Yeah, so anyway, in my trunk there's two two handguns. Uh, I've emptied them and they're in, a, in individual bags and stuff. There should be two cell phones. And I've got his ID on me, so there's only the guns, the ammo and stuff in my car. Um, Officer McGee bagged and tagged all the shell casings. Um, they're in his car, just so you guys know. Okay, I have an extra mag in this blue backpack as well as information that's relevant to another case, so I'll just file that as well. Alright. Yeah, so if you don't mind getting the stuff out of my car, I'd appreciate that. Yeah, it's out in the back, right? Yeah, it should be unlocked. Okay. 